Hey, what's going on guys? Beast of Sleeping here for another video. I know I said it would be a gaming video, but I've sort of got a bit of bad news for you guys. A little bit good-ish. <clears throat> it's one of them. It's got pros and cons on each side. So, I got an email yesterday uh, saying that by July, the, the company I work for are uh, going to hopefully, their words, hopefully be getting people back to work. Um, now that means I will probably start working again in a different venue, uh, which I'm worried about, <laughs> but it does mean I'll probably start working in a different venue. Um, it means that my schedule might be disrupted a fair bit, uh, you know, with work and whatnot, because I'm probably going to be going to a pub if I do go back. Now, I don't want to say I'm going to leave Twitch, because I'm not, okay? I'm not leaving Twitch. I might go down to four days, and I might have to change the schedule a bit to fit in, um, but I'm in the thankful position that a lot of you guys are very flexible with what you're doing um, and in your evenings, uh, which is a good thing. Uh, so the, the, it could be a fact of me ended up doing, I don't know, three nights in a daytime a week or and a, a few extras here or there when I can. Um, I don't know yet, um, which is the worrying thing because they've given us two weeks-ish notice. So already I've done like loads of online training today. Um, but that's where I stand. I'm not leaving completely. Uh, I will be pumping out YouTube videos as well as doing Twitch. And um, I will be carrying on casting with Liga Rikita, the Rocket League franchise that I'm currently casting for. Um, but in a way, COVID did bring a silver lining to me and my streaming. Like, obviously, I made it quite clear that coming back was due to having time on my hands. I came back, I wasn't expecting much. Um, I was expecting uh, maybe to grow a little bit of an audience. Um, and just chill out and have fun, but it, it's becoming very viable for me to keep on Twitch. I mean, yes, it would be my dream job to do this as a living, but with the size I am right now and and things that are going on, I can't. Um, not yet, anyway. Maybe in a year's time, maybe in a couple years' time. If I am very lucky, if I do make that break, then maybe it will be a full-time job. But right now, I need to think, I need to go back to work. So, when they give me that call to say, look, we want you back, I'll be taking it. And I'll be working again. But I will still be streaming, I'll still be making YouTube videos. Um, but, yeah, this the, the whole pandemic is helped me personally in a way where I don't know, I've got much, so much more confident in Twitch. The music is gone, which is a pain in the bomb. There we go. Um, yeah, so it's made me so much more confident. Uh, you guys are absolutely amazing. Like, we're averaging anywhere between 10 to 15 in chat now, which from when I started, I didn't think would ever happen. Uh, even when I made my first ever Twitch video, I was doing Fortnite with my geeky glasses and barely speaking, I was like, I'm never going to get three views, let alone, let alone the 15 I got, so, um, yeah. Twitch has really helped me through the pandemic, to be fair. Um, it's given me something to do, something to look forward to, to see your names in the chat, uh, to see everyone having fun, like, with my entertainment, and me entertaining people is... It's amazing and I love it. Um, the reasonings I've already gone through, but um, I will be staying. This isn't me saying goodbye, but this is me saying that changes are going to happen. Maybe not for the good uh, of, of the stream. Maybe for the good, because you might get bored seeing me five nights a week. So four nights, three nights. It may be better. Uh, I don't know. Um, but really the main thing I wanted to say for the uncertainty, which I will obviously keep you guys updated as much as I can. 
uh, when I know a lot of stuff, I'm going to be telling you guys a lot of stuff. Um, on what comes out, when I'm going back, what this means, what not. Because I want to keep you guys in the loop as much as possible. Um, but the last thing I want to say before I end the video is just a massive thank you to everyone that's come into the stream. That's followed, that's subscribed, that's gifted subs, that's donated, that's donated bits as well. Um, just thank you for supporting me and enjoying what I do. It's so easy to give criticism and it's so much harder to give praise. Um, I found, especially online with like people that are keyboard warriors and people that maybe are jealous, maybe are salty, maybe just don't like the look of you. But you guys, uh, you all come together. You're an amazing uh, community we've built. Um, I, I can't thank you guys enough. And um, it makes me want to stream. It makes me like look forward to seeing your guys' names in the stream, seeing how you're doing and whatnot. Like you wouldn't have thought it's been a couple months since I've been here on the stream and um, obviously now starting to make YouTube videos. It's amazing. Um, so thank you guys so much. Uh, I hope you carry on supporting them. We're just going to keep growing. Um, I'm going to call the video there because I think I've sort of run out of things to say. Uh, I've gone over I've gone over work. I've gone over what Twitch has done. My reason is behind it, what it means. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to finish that there. Um, I don't know if I should say I hope you enjoyed because it's not really an enjoyable video. It's more of an informational video of what's happening to me. So... Um, I hope to see you in Wednesday stream if you don't know um, that I stream if you're just watching this if you just stumbled across this then just below right here is my twitch smash a follow we're getting close to 600 um, and yeah come check me out for loads of community games and fun and I'll be back on YouTube Friday with a gaming video okay a gaming video so have a great rest of your morning afternoon evening and I'll see you guys later Peace.